Well, you got a bald guy and you got a guy with great hair. And uh, here's what we need you to do. If you're thinking about it, and I know a lot of guys are in their 20s, sometimes early 20s, sometimes late 20s, sometimes lucky, the lucky few doesn't hit to your 30s. I mean, the very, very lucky few get to their 40s or 50s. But if you're thinking about it, and we all go through it, that lose our hair, the insecurity of what should you do? And it's hard, like, you know, your wife, your girlfriend, or your mom, like, it's hard to get that advice, right? It's really more of a guy thing. And we are here for you. So send us pictures of the front, side, and top. And we need when you do the top, not just the front, but the back too, you know, you get that little, that missing spot in the back. Uh, and send us pictures, and we will tell you where whether to shave it, shave it, or save it. All right, everybody, come on down. Today's contestant is... Travis. Travis sent us a DM and his question is shave it or save it. We got a picture of Travis hanging out at the beach here. Uh, he's in the shade, John. So he doesn't, he's not wearing a hat. I'm presumably looks like he's got a, a, you know, quite a bit of red going on maybe on that, uh, very, on that smooth dome. Oh, he's a red head. So I'd imagine this is an SPF 75 situation here. Um, uh, and here is the situation with our buddy Travis, who DM'd and said, what should I do, guys? He said, here are three different photos. In fact, we ended up with four. One is from the top down with my son. You can see thin hair in the middle. One is without facial hair, and one is with facial hair. Is it time for me to shave my head and grow my beard when I'm out of the military? Or is it time to save it? So let's take a look at some of the pictures we'll be working with, what Travis was able to share with us. Uh, we had our, our first photo here, kind of a, a side photo. It gives you some of the, um, what we like to call the power alleys there. That'd be one if, you know, I, you know, he has a son, so maybe he's married. If he's married, if he's, if he was single, that would be one, like would be your Tinder profile. It's like you're on vacation, <laughs> yes. you're loose, but you're good looking, but you got the yep. water in the background. You're ready yep. for a good time. You know? Yep. This photo says I go places. Yeah. I can um, afford to travel to sweet destinations. Then here's this would be his photo. next photo. Yep, here's yeah. another photo. He's I, I, This looks like Army to me. Uh, him and uh, Lieutenant Colonel Pope there. I'm not sure. Uh, but we got, we got high and tight. This looks like a zero on the sides. Doesn't give us a great look at the top. But, you know, it, it does. We'll get back to this photo. Um, here's the photo he mentioned with his son. Um, also redhead. Also redhead where he's got his head down. And uh, he's, he's uh, baiting, baiting the hook there. And it gives us a little bit of a view of what we're, we've got on the top and kind of how he, his hair gets combed forward. You can see, can you, let me get a little closer here. We can see a little bit. Ah, shoot. Now I, you can tell it's, it's, it's definitely thinner up top. And I think when he shaved, when he had shorter hair in the photo with uh, Lieutenant Pope, which might be his wife or might've just been a fling at, you know, the, uh, the Marine dinner, uh, that he he's receding and you can tell here he grew it out and kind of, moves it forward right there that's a move so you think right here what we're looking at he's covering up some of the uh the power alley there with with some with the forward comb well i think i'm gonna listen travis I, i'm I, I have nothing but respect for your service you are a badass being in the military but you obviously got some hair problems going on because right now you obviously are receding and can you tell the thickness is not really there no, up top this is, this is he's got less he's got less depth than the uh, 49er secondary here john very thin yeah, if, if we wanted to use, you know, uh, a war analogy, you're surrounded right now. And I don't think you have help coming, <laughs> right? I, and and for reference, he sent us, he said, look, this is me before when I had the beard. I'm thinking about shaving it and growing the beard out. Here's a photo of, of, of uh, this, this photo is, <laughs> he's staring right into my eyes. It's making me a little <laughs> uncomfortable. Imagine but, him with like an you know an AR behind a tree and you were the bad guy. He Travis be coming after you. Yeah, ass. he looks like God. That is twenty twenty ready to right mow there. down the the bad guys. So that's an idea. I, um, you know, this is definitely a shave candidate. I will say this before we as, as we go through it. I think he's got a. You tell you know better than me. I think he's got a very very good dome here. This dome would work bald. He's got very good dome structure. I would say. Don't you agree? Honestly, Travis, and I, I'm a heterosexual male, your facial structure is good. I, I actually don't like the full, long, crazy, you know, like, beard he had going. I agree. I think you you have a good, like, when you did this full shave face right there, even if you just have some stubble, I think you could just shave the head, maybe not even with a Bic razor, 
but just go relatively short, like a two or a three. Yeah. And rock some stubble, rock the clean shave look. I think he looked pretty good. Yeah, I here's the medium beard, just to give you an idea of the medium beard. I think the medium beard works much better than the uh Charlie Blackman I play baseball beard. Yeah, the, the baseball Charlie beard Blackman is... or, I, or I'm a backup guard for uh, the Minnesota, you know, Vikings. Type yeah, look. nobody wants to see your the the your your the rice from your burrito two hours yeah. later. Um the medium beard works. But I'm with you here. I'm going to do something here. I think that hair John. in that picture where the water's in the back, like he, it's just much shorter. I think he pulls yeah. that off pretty well. And I think I, a lot of guys that are holding on for the for you know the last couple innings, which may for him be four or five years, you could rock that for a long period of time, that look. Uh, you agree? This right here. Yeah. I don't think this is a must shave as we talk it through because I think it's he can rock a hair that is not, that doesn't appear like he's holding on to something that he doesn't have. He's not covering it up. Um, but I also think, let's do this. For those of you watching this, I'm just going to scroll this photo up so it looks like he's bald. There you go. That's a look I of what he would look like Travis, bald and clean shaven. I think now, it works just, because you're right. He's got kind of got, he's like you, he's got some, looks like he's got a hint of dimples there. Um, I Good looking guy. I, I agree. That works right there. But I would not, I wouldn't feel obligated to do the beard thing, you know? No. Shave your, and then what's, what, what are you, uh, in the Marines? You're like, yeah, actually I was, <laughs> you know, it's a great conversation starter. <laughs> yeah. The, yeah. I mean, his eyebrow, he doesn't have, you know, because of his hair color, he doesn't have, um, like, I think the long beard look else. looks like, you know, he, he was going off on a mission or something. I mean, it just doesn't, you know, it's just whatever. I, I think the look he had yeah, I would at, do at, that. The, at the Marine ball. Yeah, this, this is, is a good. This, this is a good. This is a good photo right here. This uh, is a great photo. The, Lieutenant Pope's photo. all over you. It's a good photo because it's like, is that? Are you in a relationship with that person? Is it you just showing other women? Like, look, I'm cool with women. Women like me. Good <laughs> face, bow tie. You know, obviously a service member. So yeah, you got a lot going. And that that photo is also a good little you know primer to other women too, because like, yeah, even if we're not in a relationship, you can tell we got chemistry and we have hooked up. So I got that type vibe. <laughs> yeah, just. And like responsible. Here I am being a good dad. Yeah. What does it look like he's doing there? He's, he's baiting a hook, John. Oh, he's going fishing. Yeah. Just yeah. out, you know, just have quality time with my son. No big deal. Yep. Looks like they're, uh, they're on the base in, uh, maybe in, uh, Carolina somewhere in the probably, uh, you know, the, the South, maybe think, think how much sweeter it is to be at like Fort Bragg than Travis air force base in Vallejo Fairfield. Vacaville. <laughs> yeah. It's like why would I? I would much rather be at like the Carolina Shores than uh than yeah. Where are you? Where are you stationed? Oh, Fairfield, Vacaville area. <laughs> it's I know. like where are you? Oh, Pendleton, San Diego. Uh, c- hey, can I get shipped down there? I know. Yep, there are some good bases and there are some not as good bases. Uh, having been in the military, I mean, not me, <laughs> my dad, having <laughs> traveled. Uh, let's see, John. A few comments here. Uh. Uh, I'd go full beard and shave the head, says Brady. Miss Vic, VKC, yep, it's time to let it go. Thank you for your service. <laughs> but you don't need the facial hair. Jonathan says, drop the top, my guy. So um, I, I I think this is not this is not an emergency. We don't need to sound the alarm and uh, get everybody on the uh, deck of the uh, battleship here and shave it. But I think you could clear the deck and it will work. I. But I, I, yeah, the more we talk about it, to me, this is actually more about the shave. This is more about the beard, it turns out, the more we talk about this. I agree. I think you're, you look good, cleanly shaved. The one other thing I'll add is if he sticks with this haircut where he doesn't shave the top but keeps it like a zero on the side, people will say to you, you're the military? You're like, no, I was. <laughs> Not anymore. But you might just get that question a lot, which, you know, if you served on or believe is a good question to get asked. Also, I know it's his photo, but it also has the feel that Lieutenant Pope is the one that initiated, like, let's take a photo vibe kind of going. Doesn't well, it? Lieutenant, I mean, Lieutenant Pope's holding the camera, I would say. Yeah. A, a, a Colonel so maybe Pope. He, I don't maybe how do he took I find, Colonel Pope's uh, her Facebook page. I Colonel Pope, if, if you're are, single yeah. and she's single, you know, you might want to hit her up. Looks like she's vibing for you. <laughs> maybe she's your wife. I don't know. <laughs> she has good, good work. Not that. Yeah, that look, that, that look like, uh, Headed to basic training, trying to get his mind right. Right. You're better looking now than you were then. Put it that way. I mean, you, yeah. you know, 
Well, yeah, people get look better right. looking when they age. There you go. So that's Hopefully. another edition of uh, Shave It or Save It. So I think we're saying this is like Just a third and two situation, a second and two maybe. You can run the ball. You can throw the ball. Not urgent. I, I, li- I like the short hair look. I wish I would be able to pull that off. I just don't have yeah. enough hair up top. Yeah. It gives, I gladly gives sense would. Of what do you look like bald? You know? Gives a good, good sense luck of to you, what Travis. Look like bald. Yeah. Good luck, Travis. Thanks for your service. And uh, thanks for participating in another edition of Shave It or Save It. Uh, it's all done with love and appreciation for each and every one of you that uh, we've had now four Shave It or Save It's every single person. Thank you for your bravery in uh, letting us judge you. Armchair quarterback your head.